there, people on YouTube. I'm Ricky636. Hello, I made it to my 100th video. Well, no, nope, not a big deal, but you know, that's a uh, her video. Like a whoo, boy, am I tired? Uh, ooh, now the hell's going on? Oh, God damn, they're building these hoes left and right. It's crazy. Yeah, they're building all these hoes. And, uh... And all these people are complaining about coyotes in their backyard. Uh, raccoons in their backyard. Well, get a fucking clue, idiots. They're stealing their turf. Well, uh, they're gonna complain, keep complaining about that kind of crap. <laughs> I wish we had bear and moose. They don't know how it really feels to have critters in their backyard. It, it, it is a cool one today, but it's uh, nice enough to ride. So I'd be riding. Yeah, I'm tempted to take the wife's wife bike out, but uh, it's her bike, and I don't want to. I don't want to wreck it. She hasn't ridden it that much, so I don't want to break it. So I just take my noisy beast out. I like my noisy beast. People hear you coming. And they don't pull into bullshit. Well, some of them don't anyways. Gotta be really careful on my lake shark. And there are leaves everywhere. I think I went through the worst of it though. Oh, so some people just don't understand. Don't blow the leaves on the road. I bet your insurance is, uh, uh you have liability. Oh, you fucked up, man. Woo! <laughs> so, my buddy, he, uh, he had a Malibu, that was the one, Pro Street, he's always had hot rods, and uh, I haven't seen him in, in a while, until, uh, the last time I saw him was uh, uh, about a month and a half ago, and I asked him about his car, he said, oh I sold it, oh, so he showed me a car that he was looking at, looking at buying, and this guy either. He's a Chevy guy all the way, apparently. He had a Pro Street El Camino, oh sweet. Uh, a Nova, 1970 Nova, oh really nice. And then he got that album. So, he showed me a Mustang that he was uh, looking at buying. Well, you know, I, 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 I had to bust his balls a little. Oh, oh what? It's a Mustang. What are you doing with a Mustang? Oh. Oh, you yeah. know. I'm a Chevy guy, you know. And anyways, uh, just the other day, uh, I'm sitting in uh, my uh, living room, minding my own business, on my lawn chair, on my uh, lazy boy chair. Watching too. And all of a sudden I hear, all of a sudden I hear, oh, 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 oh. so what the fuck? Well, the back of my hair stood up, and of course I had to take a look outside. And there's this fucking Mustang, green Mustang, just, just sick. Like, I mean, this car was so fucking nice. Like, the sound of it, like, it hurt right through my house. Like, what the fuck? So. I'm not a hundred percent sure. I'm probably about ninety-nine point nine percent sure that's uh that was his his car that he was looking at, getting that Mustang. 
and this Mustang was badass. Sit low. It was see modified. Well, it was modified, but. One of these things, I'm going to catch up with him again and uh, ask him and uh, ask him if he got it. And if that was his going down the road, because his son lives just down the road from my place, so I figured maybe he might have gone past my place. Just, uh, just uh, let me uh, take a gander if it was his Mustang. Well, you know what? I'm hoping it is. It is his, his car, because that, that car was sick, man. I don't know too much about it. I just know what it sounds like and what it looks. Uh, with the modifications that it's done to it, I have no idea. Like, oh, I know, body-wise, it looks like it has some, uh, uh, some, some work to it. But, yeah, green. It looks like the same color as my bike. Is this green? Oh, yeah. Got a lot of that green. Well, you know, I, I was thinking maybe I'll uh, take a cruise by his place and see if he's up there. I'll stop by and have a little peek in his garage. See if. Uh, See, here's his butt, here's his car. Come on, what do we got here? We got a fucking tractor here. It's like, this guy gonna pass him or? what we have here. Oh, dead coon. Oh, I don't like that. But that looks like a, uh, looks like a, uh, uh, turkey ball turkey. They're ugly. Alright, anyways. Uh, they don't think a coon by his place, like I said, and, uh, Uh, that's a depressing uh, 
caught. I had a tea bucket, a 1923 tea bucket, but I didn't have room to build it, to finish it. I just, I was just tight for, for, for room. And money-wise, it was, it wasn't, it, oh, it wasn't the time. I had no garage. It was stuffed in the shed. <laughs> That's how small this car was, the uh, 23 tea. So I sold it to, uh, I sold it to my buddy's dad. He finished it. And I think it's been on the road now for about two, three years. And again, I didn't see it done, so... I see pictures, I mean, but... Personally, up close. He told me I had to... He, 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 when I talked to him, when I sold it to him, he goes, oh, yeah. He goes, I go, well, when you're done, you give me a ride. He goes, well, I'll let you drive it. Oh, okay. That would be even better. Well, I'm not going to hold it up to him, because, uh... He put a lot, of, a lot of time money into it, too, so... Again, I don't want to wreck it. I have a, I'm a bad... Uh, bad case of fucking wrecky shit. Especially it's not lying here. Yeah, oh, I... No, that's not gonna happen. I don't want to... I'll go for a ride in it. If the offers. But that's about it. Oh, and we have a full stop, and off we go. There are cops out today, so I gotta be really careful. Like, I mean, I see quite a few cops out today. But I can't afford a fine, can't afford to lose my bike. So I'm gonna settle down, be cool. Maybe I'll watch it. Maybe once in a while. I love the sound. Oh, oh. Psychology. Alright guys, as you were.